going to be showing you how to uh, plant it and you can use the on the 760 and how to view and import the photos to either a phone or a tablet phone or a tablet PC slash laptop or Mac Your camera, your camera, uh, maybe D750, other devices that have this port you can use, it's compatible, some cables, and your laptop, or your PC, or Mac, or iMac. These are like the ones that has USB ports, here, that does not have USB ports. Number one step is to find this logo. So if you look at the left, the left side of your camera, this is right. No, this is left and this is right. So left side, or if you can find it, you can see there is right here. You see that? Yep. Next to HDMI, there's this little port thing. This is the USB. So open that up and see this. You see that? See, it's small. It's smaller than HDMI. So you want to get your cable, this is my cable, here, my cable, your cable should look something like this. So you want to point it, put it in the correct direction, so yeah, so make sure you put it in the correct direction, if not it won't go in. Wait, let me just... It's a USB port. Huh, most probably all of the phones does not have a USB port. But the phone either has a type C or a micro USB. Like I have now. Okay, so now since you now okay, once it's attached right, you need to get this kind of thing. So you wanna get a USB to a micro USB if you have a micro USB phone I mean a port of from your phone or a type C if you have from your phone it depends on your phone if you have micro USB on your phone take micro USB if you have type C take type C they can be either uh, either long cable or just a very short one because uh, this cable is already fairly long enough yeah, you can either have this kind of long cable or the very short one that is like like this short does it, I mean it doesn't have any of these wires. So what you want to do now this USB port you want to fix it in. Come back here USB port. You want to fix it in. Just like this and you want to fix it in. After fixing it, you will be left with a micro USB. So, first of all, you want to on your camera. Yes, first on your camera. On your ca uh, no, I mean, first get your phone ready. On it first. So just go ahead and on it. Make sure it's on the home page. Okay. Now you want to plug this US this micro USB into the port. Okay, one step right. Okay, so now, now nothing's happening because the camera is off. Okay, look. So look at the so now you wanna on it straight away. It should be on unless you have something like maybe you have. Uh, yeah, sure. If you when you on it, should straight away uh activate. Or if you have a problem like mine, it keeps saying clock has been reset. Just click OK and then shoot. So when I click on, uh, something should happen. So I click on. Oops, sorry. OK. 
okay when i click on just clear all tabs it's better than that okay i want to on three two one okay nothing click OK this should happen and this light in the camera this light here should be record uh, should be green you see it's blinking a bit and it should automatically detect all of the photos the more photos you have the longer it takes okay now time to show how to do on the laptop or laptop PC Mac or iMac Okay, now I got my laptop ready. So now what you want to do on your laptop, go to File Explorer. You see File, file Explorer. I mean, you want to go to your file, like where you keep all the files, you download, you want to go to that. For PC, it should be File Explorer or like this kind of logo. Or um, I might, it should be something like, um, it looks something like this, but everything is blue. So click it so open it up and then and then um and then you want to go to the bottom left you want to see this you see that desktop documents uh you want to stay here let me un okay so you want to stay here all right just yeah, stay here Okay, look. So you want to be here. Okay, so now you want to take out that extender. I mean, this USB to micro USB and plug it into your, uh, a USB port. So my USB port is right here. Let me show you right here. Different laptops may vary. I mean different laptops the the USB port may be somewhere else could be on the other side no I don't, we don't I don't know okay so you want to plug it in as, as you can see my camera is off I just off it okay, so plug it in so plug it in uh, the other way around when it fits okay so now nothing's happening okay the, now nothing is happening so i want to on it wait a minute okay as soon as i click this okay look, you just heard that so now you should get this file you should get your camera i mean you should get your camera your model name it should be a camera icon and your model and your model name and your model for the camera or you could also get it like this okay so now you wanna i wanna open the camera okay open the camera and so you see look so um you have this file so just click the one that you want to open. DCIM. Uh, choose. Choose ND, I think. Yeah, choose CD. It doesn't work. Choose N. You want to choose D75. You don't want to choose CD40. That is maybe your SD card that is your own camera. Choose D. If, if there's only one, just click D75. And you got all of these photos. It's all of these photos. So you see this, and you see when mouse has loading, it's loading all the photos as well as the camera is also working the lights. Yeah. So yeah, that's how you transfer your. I mean, not how to transfer. That's how to view and do it. So you could just. Uh, let's see, I choose this photo. I can just right click and I can um, just copy I and mean, delete from the thing. I can do whatever, whatever I want. Yeah, okay. So, and then after that, uh, you can have anything. Okay, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in a brand new video. Bye. If you have any questions,
comment below. Thank you. Bye-bye.